Hey what's going on guys and welcome to another old school video. So I'm currently at Cave Horrors and I do not have a Slayer assignment for these, that's why I have my normal uh, proselyte helmet on. But the reason why I am here is actually to make money. I am just going to try to be here and get one black mask because I currently have 80k cash. I mean my bank is like 13 mil overall but I can't really sell any of the items. It's all in actual gear that I use every single time I slay and prayer pots and stuff like that. So I can't actually sell it but I want some money. So I'm going to try to get one black mask and hopefully it doesn't take too long. I don't know. I might be here for like 10k kills. Who knows? But if I do get one black mask, mask it's going to to be 1.3 mil so that is very nice okay um that was literally after i recorded that <laughs> that's a black mask <laughs> holy shit that was fucking crazy 1.3 mil that is uh, pretty nice i guess i'm going to spend a bit more time here you know what i'm just going to use i don't know if i use all these prayer pots but i'm going to use quite a lot of these prayer pots and see if i can get a second black mask jesus that was crazy so I've been away for a while and I've been playing on my phone, I was away during the weekend and I played some RuneScape on my phone during the time so I couldn't actually record anything but I did get a second black mask and this is how all the loot that I've got from using all the prayer pots I had in my inventory plus like 10 more at Cave Horrors and I'm about to run out of prayer here so I'm going to end the trip now and I have, I have two goals for this video that I want to complete. I want to get 80 Slayer which is 124,000 experience off and then I want to complete Death treasure maybe I won't be able to do that because it's quite a lot of questing but I hope to be able to because at 80 I unlock necreals and the ancient magics versus those is completely insane so anyways I'm just going to do a quick price check here and actually the price of the black masks dropped like 100k since I last recorded but let's see what the uh, profit from this is I got a lot of these snapdragon seeds which is worth a lot of money holy shit three almost three mil from this this is actually so good yeah, that's going to help me out a lot. Oh, and also, I, of course, I had a hard clue from killing all those cave horrors, but I cannot complete it, so I'm gonna have to drop it. I'm currently on a greater demon task, and I got a hard clue, so let's open it and see what we get. Oh, that is 59k. That is actually terrible. This has to be worth, absol uh, worth absolutely nothing, because, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of rune items. Is this going to be like... Oh my god, <laughs> that's so bad. Another hard clue from Bloodvelds, and I currently need 103k experience left to 80. Alright, let's see if this one is better than 59k, hopefully. Yeah, it definitely is. 400k. Wait, what even cancelled it? Oh, my prayer was still on. That's an armadillo page. I thought it was Saradomi first. Armadillo page 1, very nice. 150 tasks completed for 225 points, which was very well needed. I have a total of 241 now, so if I get shitty tasks, I can finally skip them. Oh, it's actually been a while since I had a superior slayer creature, so this is going to be a marble gargoyle, and let's see what we get. That was a weird animation, and the drop is pretty shitty, but hey, that's a hard clue. I'm going to actually finish the task, I'm gonna go 59 left, and then I'll do the hard clue, hopefully I can do it. I'm gonna call a 160k hard clue. Ah, 82k, that's half of the <laughs> expected value. Oh, I didn't even know. 82 defense. Am I close to another level? Yeah, I guess pretty close to strength and attack and 6k to 87 hit points. Pretty nice. Okay, so I just hit 84 ranged and almost at the same time 87 hit points and I am so close to 105 combat. Oh, this is perfect timing. I'm going to get 80 Slayer on this superior Kurask. Hopefully I can get an imbued heart as well at the same time. There we go. 80 Slayer. It has been achieved and the drop is pretty mediocre. But anyways, now we can go for Desert Treasure and have Ancients and be able to kill Necreals. Oh, and uh, 85 strength right after, and that should be 105 combat as well. Pretty nice milestone. Is it just me who thinks this is very confusing? Here, if you look at it, uh, it says the dig site quest, and the dig site is together, but in the quest log here, it's the dig site with a space. I was like, is this another quest, or is this actually the one? But yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one. I am not looking forward to all this questing, but that is the first quest comp- Whoa, that's actually a lot of <laughs> experience in mining, but that is the dig site completed, one of quite a few quests I have to do. I'm also going to hit 100 quest points for this, so I get another block on my slayer list. And that is the Taurus trap completed, I'm going to actually pick thieving, because I need thieving for uh, the next quest I want to do, or one of the quests I need. Uh, I think it's Temple of Ikov, I need the 42 thieving, and I was only 41, so... 
Anyways, that is the quest done, and I can also make dodge now. I guess that's uh, some bonus thing I got. 101 quest points, so yeah, I can uh, block another slay creature now. Now, this is what I call a real boss battle, a level 14. When I kill him, I'm going to be done with Temple of Ikov, so I'm going to be done with three quests. And there we go, he is dead. Hopefully it doesn't take too long for his chat to be done. Okay, there we go. 10,000 range experience and 8k fletching. Absolutely great experience for such an easy quest. Did I get any levels? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Pretty close to 56 fletching though. But that is three quests completed. Alright, we're getting really close to be able to do Desert Treasure, that is the Death Plateau completed, 3k attack experience, Steel Claws, nice, ability to make claws, I'm never going to do that most likely, but hey, it's something. So now we only have to do Troll Stronghold, I think it was, and then I can do Desert Treasure. Let's uh, click this, yep, yeah, it's uh, Troll Stronghold, and then I have everything for Desert Treasure. Okay, there we go. That was a very fast quest. I thought it would be a longer one. It was a while since I did this, but yep, that is all the requirements done for Desert Treasure. So let's do that now. And then we have Ancients and we can kill Necreals. And hopefully my ne next Slayer assignment will be Necreals, but that's maybe a bit too much to ask for. Actually, you needed a 53 thieving and also 50 fire making to be able to do desert treasure. And I've done the ice crystal or ice diamond, but on the smoke one, I think you need 53 thieving. So I'm going to get that and also 50 fire making just to have every skill done. I'm going to do pyramid plunder for these 10 levels, and then the 10 fire making levels will just be extremely easy. Okay, here we go. That is uh, 53 thieving done. Now I just need 50 fire making. And here we go, this is going to be 50 fire making, very easy skill of course, took no time at all to get that. So now we can complete Desert Treasure, finally. Okay, this is a great feeling, Desert Treasure is finally done and I can now use Ancient, and I'm about to get a text message on my phone, so sorry if there's a sound, but anyways, here we go. Oh, dude, are you serious? These scarabs actually just interrupted me, can I get them stuck on the mob or the NPC? Okay, there we go. That's the treasure completed. I can now use ancient magics. I don't know if it's actually worth me swapping to ancients right now. Probably isn't. I should probably swap back because of the teleports that I can use with this is more beneficial right now. But as soon as I get a necreal task, I will go here and swap to ancients. Back to Slayer and that is 83 attack. I am pretty much halfway to 106 but I did actually not swap back to the normal spellbook because I was like ah it's actually not that important. The teleports I have a glory anyways and dueling ring and stuff like that. Then I remembered well I don't have Alex with this so it was definitely a mistake not to swap back so I need to do that. That is actually the first dragon medhelm I've ever seen from a Slayer drop. Interesting. This is when we want to see Necreals. Ankus, ah, yeah, that's a very fast task for easy points. That's going to be 160 tasks as well, so some extra points. Alright, there you go, 75 points for that task. Let's get Necreals this time. Black Dragons, that is a very good task. I love brutal Black Dragons. I'm such a big fan of the money you get from this. 11 kills and like 250k cash, that is so nice. But anyways, let's get another task. Hopefully something good. Skeletal Vyverns, that is also- I'm getting so many easy tasks. Ankus, Black Dragon, Skeletal Vyverns, it's like one ki one trip s assignments that takes literally like 5 minutes to do. Maybe this one's going to take a bit longer, but hey. Oh nice, that's a 160k drop from Skeletal Vyverns. That's going to be a pretty good task money-wise. I got a blue dragon task and I really dislike this task and I have 150 points so I am actually going to block this now that I can do that so that is both steel dragons and blue dragons blocked which is really nice let's get another assignment greater demons that is a pretty bad one but yeah it, it should go pretty fast but that is going to do for this video I'm currently on a Kursk task and I had to kill like a shit ton of them I don't know why it says three greater demons here I guess I have to check again 146 but it started with like 198 so yeah I had to kill a lot of them I actually forgot my ring of wealth here which is really good for picking up all the coins that you get from uh, the Kursks but anyways I thank you all for watching the video was a bit shorter than normal I guess but I had to do a lot of questing and also quite some slayer so yeah yeah, that's what happens but I hope you guys did enjoy it and I'll see you in the next one guys take care and hopefully in the next one we can do neck reels